Welcome back. Netflix has announced there will be a second season of the documentary series on the EMCC football team. International acclaim has poured in for the last chance you, as many critics compliment the honest behind the scenes look at the junior college football. Tommy Lopez has more from East Mississippi's campus in Scuba. Most college football teams invite media to a preseason event like EMCC did this week, but most do not have a film crew following the coaches and players every move. It scares the bejesus out of you because you're, you're like, you know, I don't know what, you know, I don't know what they're going to get on film. I don't know what they're going to see. But the, the great thing about it is, is we have great kids. We have great people in our college. These are the men and women behind Last Chance U. They're already working on the second season of the series. I feel like we already have a target on our back anywhere we go. And then I guess the Netflix show just makes it a bigger, more bigger target. I think it's pretty cool, actually, knowing that they got kicked out last year, knowing that these guys are hungry and ready for another opportunity to get back to win a national championship. Most of the players tell me they stayed up all night to watch the series when it was released. As these players are going about their daily lives now, camera crews from the Netflix documentary series are going to be on site. They're talking about everything from what they're eating to how they're feeling to how practice is going here in Scuba. It made me have to be very introspective in the fact that, that I, there were things that I need to change about me. There were things I need to change about my coaching style. The creators of the series are tackling new issues for what they might change for season two. There are challenges to making a second season. You don't just want to repeat the first season. At the same time, you don't want to completely ditch what worked the first season. People have fallen in love with a handful of characters and they're very interested in what happens to those people. Those interested people include Snoop Dogg. The rapper tweets this out after the release. The Lions say this week that it's time to put the attention aside and focus on winning what would be the school's fourth football national championship in the past six years. In Scuba, Tommy Lopez, WCBI News. And the creators of the series say they will continue to follow players that have graduated like Louisville native Wyatt Roberts, who is now playing at Mississippi State. 